Hi, this is Shirai. Today is April 13, 2011. The time is 12 minutes after 10 p.m. At approximately 9.15 today, my room 234 at the hotel caught on fire. I'm in now room 240. There was an electrical um, problem with the heating and air conditioning. Air conditioning. I'm a little shaken up. I was laying in bed, and all of a sudden I heard a pop, and the whole wall set ablaze. This is quite interesting. It is. It's like someone's trying to murder me. If I were, I was about to fall asleep, and that wall circuit would have caught a blaze. I would have been trapped inside the room. The worst case scenario, which is really interesting. I saw the fire. I didn't know what to do at first. I told myself to calm down. I turned off the air conditioned heating system unit, and then the walls were still on fire. I heard popping, and the flames got a little larger and taller on the wall. So what I did was I basically saw the flames hit the rug and some fl some of the flames caught the rug on fire. I taken a dry towel and burned it out and prayed the Lord that the electrical wall will also diffuse itself, which it did. And then I contacted the manager as I was doing it and I asked him to call 911. This happened approximately 9.15 this evening. I'm a little shaken up about all of this. I was told yesterday something was supposed to happen today when I was out. And it has something to do with identity stuff. I think someone is trying to murder me now over it. And that was the proof. I heard some rumors that it was set up. They actually set it up. Someone went in there and rigged on the other side of the room in order to cause a fire. So what I did was I took pictures and I will forward it to the proper authorities. I'm a little shaken up. I don't want to unpack. I don't want to sleep. I, I couldn't believe this just happened to me. It's pretty, it's pretty damn scary right now. Um, one of the maintenance person had showed up immediately, which was strange because I never, I, I made the call, but he, it's like he knew and he showed up in the process. Before the manager got there, he was there. So what does that tell you? And this is the individual who didn't like me, and I had forwarded you his vehicle, which he now told me got a new vehicle. But I think this is kind of strange. He knew a lot about the electrical units, and he told them to turn it off before he take a hammer and hit it with the wall. They didn't want to call the fire department. I called 911. I left my name, my first and last name. And I also, um, they said they were going to contact the fire department to make sure. And the fire department did show up about uh, about 9, I want to say 9.30, 9.20, something around that time. So I did take pictures. I'm a little shaken up about this. And I told you that people are targeting me over my ID. They're serious about killing me over it. This was no joke. I had people threatening me, and now you know the truth. 